Hello, welcome to All Saints News. My name is Emrys. Over the holidays, a sixth form managed to organise a number of charitable events which involved the whole school, one of which was a friendly football match which faced students against teachers. On a Wednesday afternoon, the sixth formers and teachers participated in a friendly football match to help raise money for charity. To help celebrate the season, both teachers and students alike dressed in tutus and fairy wings. The six formers were first to score, but in a lucky and even controversial upset, the teachers came back and scored three quarters through the match. One six form had this to say about the teacher's goal. Mrs. Oh, I feel very disappointed. We were all working the whole game. His goal was a deflection and we caught him up. When he took control of the ball, he used his hand and he was offside. And I feel Kira's goal, which went in, no, no questions asked, should have been captured. For our second story, students and teachers alike were able to purchase a sixth form slave for an entire day. Done in the form of an auction, the event was organised by Mr. Horncastle. The slaves are prepared to do anything that's legal, decent, and moral. Uh, with the exception of one or two, are prepared to do almost anything. As a result, we have some fine specimens. We have male ones, female ones, black ones, white ones, and some of the girls are orange. <laughs> Thursday's event was a student auction where six form students were sold as slaves to raise money for charity. The highest teacher bid was for £31 by Miss Hamilton. Joseph, a year nine student, had this to say about his bid. So how much did you end up spending? I spent £16 on my side. £16? Yeah. How was your experience in it? It was good. What did you do in the day? I made her carry my bag, I made her carry my books, and I let her have a break. And finally, teachers and students were able to get out their aggression by putting on a fat suit and going head-to-head -head in a sumo ring. For Friday's event, students paid £1 for a sumo suit and rest in the pool. The Honourable Mr Adams refereed the events. The teachers also had a knockout competition where Mr Sweeney was left victorious. Mr O'Brien, however, was not so lucky. He had this to say. Why did you lose? Because the small man has the big advantage, the tall man has had a disadvantage. Unfortunately, for me, it wasn't my day. Are you strong, Of course I'm stronger. Mr. Sweeney ain't got no game, he ain't got no muscle. I'm the man with the muscle. Check it out. Right? Tickets to the gun show. Bam! We were able to interview Mr. Bonner, head of sixth form, about his views on the events. So, what made you think of the idea? Um, well, we've got a very big sixth form, and I think a lot of people feel once they join the sixth form, they aren't such a big part of the school. And so we thought we wanted to get them involved in the school. Uh, we wanted to uh, get them involved with some of the younger kids. And how much money did you raise for them? About just over a thousand pounds for those three days, so we did pretty well. Thank you for watching.